What is going on everybody? It's your boy Titanic Feet Jack and I'm back at you again with another video. I would like to welcome you guys back to the channel. If you'd like to continue following me as I build my sneaker collection, here's a list of my socials right there. Also, do me a favor, drop a comment, hit that like button, and if you haven't already, sub up to the channel. Now today we're taking a look at a sneaker. This one is for the ladies. Uh, it's on the iconic silhouette, the Air Jordan Retro 1. Uh, this sneaker is basically got its inspiration from a high school varsity jacket. So uh, you can see some chenille on here on the swoosh. It's actually one of the nicknames of this sneaker, the chenille. Chanel, not sure if I'm pronouncing it right, but don't kill me in the comments. It also has the nickname of New Stalger, but this is like the first majority red and white Air Jordan 1 we've had in quite some time. Uh, it's a very nice sneaker, and I've learned that they came in extended sizes overseas. I actually can get a pair. I've been eyeing them and I'm really thinking about getting me a pair. So let's get into it. This is the box. The inverse of the men's Jordan 1 box. You got the majority red box, black writing. Okay guys, let's read the label. It says women's air Jordan 1 retro high OG color light iron or varsity red seal. And this is a U.S. women's size 10, which is a men's 8.5 or 8.5. And, and the retail price is $178. And here is the lot stamp right here. The red lot stamp. And you also have your, your tissue, like white or seal color tissue paper. And inside the box, you can see that YDM sticker. This was a retail cop on the Nike sneakers app. These were pretty easy to get. And at the time of recording this video, they're all pairs still sitting at my local Hibbit store. So if you want these, they're out there for retail. Here we go is the Air Jordan 1 High OG Nostalgia or the Chanel. You're looking at a red base, I'm sorry, a white base with the majority red on top. You can see the leather on here. It's a decent grain of leather. Some parts just feel softer than the other. You can see that light iron or color of uh, Jordan Wings logo, which is branded on. You have white on your quarter panels. You have that uh, varsity red going around your ankle collar. Down your lace eyelets and around your mud guard, and you have that Chanel material on your swoosh, trimmed in uh, white. Looking at the midsole, you got that sail color midsole with varsity red at the very bottom, which leads to the outsole. Your regular Air Jordan 1 outsole in a varsity red colorway. And this is the hang tag, it comes in this little classic thing and if you look closer you can see it's a varsity red chanel tag that says nike air and white looking at the heel your typical jordan one uh heel you have that light iron or color around the ankle collar and you got your chanel swoosh coming from the other side now we on the medial side of the sneaker you have that white leather on your quarter panels and your varsity red around your ankle collar heel and going down the lace eyelets and your mud guard sail color midsole varsity red at the very bottom let's get the shoe tree out called bull shoe tree size eight eight and a half which is a men's size and you have die cut sock liner printed inside the uh shoe tree and we're gonna take a look at that toe box this is the leather on the toe box 
feels pretty soft on here. Comes factory lace with varsity red laces. It also comes with another set of laces. It comes with these sale color laces right here. So comment below, let me know what color laces would you be rocking these with? Yes, this time it went with a rib textile material on your tongue and it's in the iron ore colorway. You also got your lace loop right here. Also, there's an iron ore woven patch on here with the Nike Air branding in the Varsity Red colorway. And on the back side, you know, more of that plush material. And look at that ankle collar going around. Your ankle is in that iron ore colorway. Excuse me, it keeps flapping up on me. And we got you right here. Read that sizing tag, US size 10, production day June 15th, 2021 to January 13th, 2022. So about six months of production with these. We're gonna look at your insert. You got an iron or colorway insert with a Nike Air brand and you got a sticker in here that say full pair. F-A-U-X pair and now uh, and that's pretty much the sneaker so comment below let me know if y'all like these or what's your feeling about it me personally I like it and if uh I can finally get that fact check that they did come out and extend the size overseas I'll definitely be getting me a pair of these so like I always tell you, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know, it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack, signing out.